Hi, I'm Ayo Tunde. Balogun here's your Channels TV Morning News update for December the 1st, 2019. The candidate of the All Progressives Congress, Senator Smart Adeyemi, has won the Kogi West Senatorial District election, thereby replacing Senator Dino Malai of the People's Democratic Party in the National Assembly. Senator Adeyemi polled a total of 88,373 votes to beat Senator Dino Malai, who scored 62,133 votes. The returning officer of the election, Professor Olajide Lawal, declared Senator Adeyemi as the winner of the keenly contested election two weeks after the people of the senatorial district went to the poll. Meanwhile, the police say they are investigating an attack on the Federal Road Safety Corps officials traveling from Abuja to Lagos on the Lokaja Okene Highway. According to the State Police Command, bandits ambushed the vehicle of the FRSC officers in Oshawa, a town close to Lokoja, killing the driver while other officers were critically injured. In Yobe, the state government is seeking to partner with traditional rulers and lawmakers to end gender-based violence. Addressing journalist Damaturu, Speaker of the Yobe State House of Assembly, says the lawmakers have already passed the State Penal Code 2018, which stipulates life imprisonment for rape cases in the state. On the international scene, the Democratic Republic of Congo's army says it has killed a rebel leader in the country's northeast, hours after attackers killed at least 13 people in the rest of the region. This comes as the era reels from a string of recent attacks that have killed scores of people over the past month, prompting angry protests this week by residents accusing local and international forces of failing to protect them. And in sports, Manchester City's hopes of defending their English Premier League title has been dealt another blow after playing a 2-2 draw with Newcastle at St James's Park. Elsewhere, West Ham stunned Chelsea at Stamford Bridge 1-0, courtesy of a goal from Aaron Creswell in the 48th minute, while league leaders Liverpool held on for a 2-1 victory over Brighton after being reduced to 10 men. That's the news update. Don't forget to join us later today for the evening news recap. I'm Ayotunde Balogun. Many thanks for watching.